Hi friends. Um, it is the 4th of July. I'm counting my blue shirt. But I'm only going to be wearing this blue shirt for um, a couple more hours. We're going to have multiple uh, outfit changes. One of which is in here. That cute shirt that I got yesterday at Old Navy. I've got a, um, that red shirt and a pair of blue jean shorts um, packed. But I'm going to change into a tank top and some maybe even some beach shorts or just some casual shorts. Right now I just have these cute little Hawaiian ones on. Um, but we've got the car mostly packed up for the 4th of July, going out to our friend's house. We're gonna have a barbecue at their house. Kids can go to the lake um, to swim. It's gonna be 80 degrees to get today. So super, it's super warm outside already. Um, and then we will go over to the park, over to Remlinger Park, where they're gonna shoot off fireworks. If you have been with us for a couple years, this is our tradition. Our friends um, lovingly allow us to come and join their family and um, extended family. Um, and then other friends join in. It's just become our tradition. Um, and, but two things. One, I'll show you what they're doing behind me. But when <laughs> you think it's exhausting to do all the things that we've been doing lately. It is like all these house projects, swapping rooms. I cleaned my room. I made a new desk all the things right try editing that video again and you remember the exhaustion you're having to like listen to yourself and look at yourself like be exhausted and like like you remember and so i was i was filming or editing yesterday and the day before and abby kept coming into the room and she's like how do you watch that over again that day was exhausting <laughs> it's like it is it's hard to re-watch it it, it is hard, but we're doing it again. Mildly. <laughs> Ashley, this is the one thing I haven't put together or had my hands on, thank you very much. This is Ashley's Alex drawer. She's very jealous of the two that we have set up. you said I was gonna get I did say that you were gonna get one, but we're just exhausted and I'm trying to get caught up on life. But dad has lovingly um, taking his morning off to help her put that together and I love that they yes he was I'll go show what Abby's got going in her room um, I love that they actually attached these they used to not you used to have to do that yourself but I love that these come attached so they are gonna work on that and right there's more behind you there's two behind you um, yeah I'm gonna let them do that and Abby has installed, with Jason's help, two new shelves that she painted the color of her ceiling so it kind of matched the same white in her room. And she got a new mirror and she got a new nightstand. Let me see if she'll let me show you. So she just put these shelves up today. They look really good, Abby. Yeah. You're right. These little um, ceramics that she's made, they needed to be displayed. Like, and this one needed to be up so you could see all that fine work. Like all those flowers, she handmade. Yeah. Yeah. And then this one, I wanted this one so bad. Of any of the ones that my kids have made, this is the one that I wanted the most. But I have to say, it looks really good in the room. The Scorpigo took like three days. Yeah. But I love like the ombre and it looks really good with your wall color. Mm -hmm. So... Um, you should put like one other little thing right here, yeah. like a little set of threes. And then she also made these guys. Don't you should put like a little flower in them. It's a vase. That there's holes uh -huh. through all three. So she's got all of her lotions and sprays lined up. Super cute. Oh, you made this one too. That's really fun. And then we picked up this nightstand at Target the other day. And at the same time, um, we love the wood. We needed to bring in some warm color because there's a lot of whites and grays and blues. Um, so we went ahead and got, <laughs> sorry, you're in the mirror. Um, we went ahead and got this Magnolia mirror and it has that same wood tone that the um, nightstand has. So it really looks good and warms up the room. She also put these little postcards up on the wall and they look super cute. It would even be fun, Abby, if we like, got like a four like frame or something or I tried looking for postcards in Japan and they didn't I know they didn't have anything so but I do like the Hawaiian ones. 
I won't show Chelsea because she's probably in here. Real. Oh, you're changing. <laughs> well, that's a cute. Can I show you? That's a really cute outfit, Chelsea. Well, I put these on to test if they fit. And they They're fit. from Kaylee. Yeah. That is a really cute outfit. How fun. You should wear that to the lake today. Well, I might, but I was also going to bring these for... Yeah, 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 for fireworks. Yeah. That's really cute. It matches perfectly. Well, I just wanted to kind of show you their room kind of put back together. You saw it in a photo if you looked at the thumbnail. Yeah. Um, but they... Well, th their beds aren't made. It's never going to be picture perfect again. Mine is technically made. I just have to put the pillow correct. Correct. I know. I know. Um, but this is currently what Ashley is going to do with her Alex drawers. Abby gave her that set there, which she may or may not keep. Um, but it'll look cleaner if we have everything in the Alex drawer. And it'll fit. We'll probably just put it in place of the two legs that are on the table now. Um, we have a whole set of legs that we don't need anymore <laughs> because of that. Um, but they will have a dividing line <laughs> on this table. Um, once you start school, yeah. this will have to be like workstation. Yeah. Right now I'm allowing Ashley to do um, oh. some craft work. This is their, their business. <sighs> stresses me out. I don't really like this being up here. Maybe you guys could work on cleaning this off today. Oh, I know. Did you eat the popcorn last night though? Yeah. There you go. But it's her. All right. So, yes. She wouldn't try on these shorts at the store the other day. Did I take you guys? Oh, I did. She wouldn't try them on and they don't fit. <laughs> so I have to find another day. Do you guys, when you go through your projects and you get them done, do you ever like look back at your work? Like the day later, two days later, you look back at your wonderful work. We're just gonna go look one more time. It was so nice to get ready here at my desk, come over where you can actually see it. You know, it's just nice. Who got out this flat iron? Hmm. Maybe Chelsea did. But it works right here, right? Got my little mat there. I enjoyed watching YouTube last night and then I went to bed at 10. Made bed this morning. So we are feeling really good about our clean house. I vacuumed this entire room last night. Um, this room out here is all vacuumed. Their room, their bedrooms are vacuumed. As soon as they get the dresser put together, I will be able to vacuum downstairs. <laughs> I'm really not wanting to do like work work today. So, got the car packed up with lawn chairs and the wagon to carry everything in. And um, in a little bit, I need to start making corn dogs. But I need to look up the recipe and make sure I have everything. Probably should have done that on a different day than actually on the 4th of July. But I only have one load of laundry and it's already done. I just I'm shutting that door because I don't want to fold it and put it away. You okay? Now we have to get a yellow towel. Okay, I'm gonna go back to edit. When I come back, that's gonna be put fully put together. And maybe we'll make corn dogs or do something else. Get ready to go. That'll be fun. I dried some of it. Some of it's wet. Okay. Wouldn't be the 4th of July without a last minute trip to the store for snacks. Yeah, I feel bad too. I do too. But uh, I realized we don't have any snacks to eat during the fireworks. You always like have dinner and you're doing good and then you get over to the fireworks and you're like, I need a nibble. I need a nibble. So we got E.L. fudge and a bucket of licorice. Wait, wait, wait. Let's put the pop in there first. And then I was like, oh, we should take a case of sodas pop. to share. Sodas, pop, whatever. So it Through was the South Coke. It was buy two get three free. So that's not gonna close. So that's a good deal. So and I didn't buy Coke. I got sugar or yeah, zero sugar ginger ale. Then I got root beer for the kids and fresca. But we're only gonna take the ginger ale tonight. And then because grapes are always on a good sale at Safeway during the summer. We got a whole bag of them. 
Like this is all grapes. Jason's gonna go home and he's gonna rinse them all and put them in the freezer because his favorite summer snack is frozen grapes. Correct? Yep. What do we got set up here? Corn dogs. Corn dogs. And we're gonna use my Hawaiian honey. Oh. Ooh. Did you catch it? Nope. Oh. Okay. Why are you on? Stop. Come back to doing your job. All right, I am doing the grapes. He's cleaning the grapes and bagging them up. For bagging the them up to freeze them. Nothing better than that. Ashley, what are you doing? You're drying the hot dogs. Chelsea, what are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? Oh, okay. let me tell you about. Uh, wash your hands. Don't forget to wash your hands. Let me tell you about Scott. What do you mean? So, so Kaylee has her other rooster, and he's back at um, Jacob's house. But since they're gone, they had to take the rooster to a babysitter. Wait, is it just a babysitter or is it full time? No. Because I thought the neighbors were getting upset with him. Yeah, the neighbors are getting upset they're with him. Jacob's home after neighbors. They couldn't find him right. a good home until. We're going to get back from this trip. Yeah. Right. <laughs> no, that's what they said. No, because no, the I other know, guy cause... that I could have or take him to, he might eat it. Right. It, and Kaylee didn't want that. He's right. not plump enough. So the babysitter that's true. that is that's hosting the bird right now, can I get into the, can we switch places? Yeah. So the babysitter, Chelsea and Kaylee went we'll over the and <laughs> cleaned out the coop the other day before Kaylee left. And got it all set up for spot, yeah. and then and took they took the bird over the other day, and everything is fine. Well, my friend who lives next door—that's how we got the re referral for this chicken um, babysitter. She texted me today, and she said, "Um, does my neighbor Ooh. have your chicken?" Chicken. <laughs> I was like, "They sure do." And she's like, yeah, I heard him. I've heard him all morning long. He woke us up nice and early. Oh yeah, <laughs> she's, he loves doing that. Yeah, so, so anyway. It's a little annoying. It's okay. So, it's okay. <laughs> drink the honey. It's okay. Pour uh, or spray your spoon with oil with the Oil on it. Okay, I gotta keep going. I gotta all right, right, we'll show you the magic stuff at the end. Okay, here we go. Got our corn dogs in. Jason's cut my skewer sticks. They need to make corn dog skewer sticks that will fit in your pan. So, kind of need to cook the hot dog too. So, kind of turn my temperature down a bit. I'd say they look pretty good. Might need to taste test one really quick. All right, making corn dogs goes fast. You're constantly just moving, so they're all done. <laughs> it's hard to pick up the camera, um, but I've got the last five in there. And we ended up making four packages of corn dogs, and I'm going to wrap them up. I have cute trays to put them on as soon as we get there. Um, and we did try them, right, Jace? Yeah, they're good. We had to try it. And he's not a corn dog person. No, not. Uh, no I had to turn it down, and so it kind of got a little bit too too cooled down so I'm kind of letting these guys um cook a little bit longer it was funny but it's a little too cheesy <laughs> what was <laughs> your, your joke my joke was awesome sure. okay right. so a little while ago we're going down the hill and Dana realizes she forgot something again so we have again, to go back I for only forgot <laughs> funny thing. Yeah. every yeah. single every time day. because so I have to get so everyone else so she else's turns crack. and does a sharp little turn we go back home and get it. And we're coming back down the hill. And she's like, oh, are the corn dogs okay? Or did they fall over when we took the corner? And I was like, well, if they fell over, now they're going to be corner dogs. <laughs> that's an awesome dad joke. You're so dumb. In the moment, I made it up. That's awesome. Happy yeah, Happy fourth. Happy, Share that joke with joke. all your loved ones. It's not a joke unless you're in the car with corn dogs. <laughs>
happens, we didn't pick up the camera. <laughs> and I've changed my clothes. I didn't actually go down to the the lake, neither did he. But you guys went down, right? Yeah. yeah. You went down and swam? Okay, shot of the lake, it's beautiful. Oh yeah. So there's the little lake. They didn't do like the like big barbecue here like they, they have done in the past. So we just sent the kids down here to hang out. All right, so um, but we had a good time. We had great food, great friends, and uh, the host had his two sisters there and their kids and we had a good time. So I have, I didn't, because I wasn't, I was dressed to go and sit at the lake and get some sunshine and whatnot. And so now I have changed my clothes to be more festive. I've got my red shirt and my blue shorts and kind of fitting in more with the, the holiday vibe. You guys didn't do that, did you? You guys are done with the days of uh, letting me do your outfit. Trust you in red well, I would blue. if you did. You know, you are aware of the holiday. You could have decided to wear a shirt that was okay, red, white, well, or blue. I was in the middle of like redoing our room, and my room is like I know. Mess I understand. Like, I know. Like, you need to brush your hair. I do have a comb. Uh, no. Okay. Well, we're gonna head over and save a spot, um, and they're all gonna come over. They're waiting for some family to come back to the house. And we're gonna go save spots at the park and get ready for fireworks. And I think I'm excited for some of the treats more than I, <laughs> I brought, um, we got that stop. licorice. And, well, I didn't, you didn't stop eating. What, I had one hamburger and... I know, you just nibbled. Like, they had a jello cake at the end that was kind of a... I only had two or three bites. That was really, really yeah. good. But our friends always uh, make ribs. Your battery's dead. I know. They make ribs, and I have my corn dogs and a salad. So I ate good tonight. I had good red meat. Um, I just don't. I don't eat red meat very often. So, anyways, let's head to the park.